Yes, today we're talking about Yu-Gi-Oh. I don't care. I don't care. We're doing this. For whatever reason, I never saw this anime as a kid. I think I was too old. But I'm really glad I didn't because now I get to watch it as an adult and appreciate just how bad good it is. For whatever reason, I watched it, okay? I watched it. I watched the whole season. But I want to focus on episode one because if you don't know anything about Yu-Gi-Oh, the whole episode is just like, what is happening? I love it. Let's, let's review the episode. You know, other animes have some inspiring message. We're gonna be the number one. That kind of thing. Here's just like, <laughs> so bad. Hey, Joey. Earth to Joey. Hey, are you in there? It's your turn. Oh, isn't he cute when he- So the anime starts off with the main protagonist, uh, Yugi and Joey. For whatever reason, Joey speaks in like a thick New York He's accent. Speaking. Hey, Tristan, Yugi here's teaching me how to play duel monsters. Drooling monsters? Duel monsters, you Nimrod. <sighs> Sheesh. They've been at it for hours. Joey's starting to get the hang of the game. They've been at it for hours in school. The game is so addicting. Go buy it now. They've been at it for hours. But Yugi's like an expert. Okay, Yugi. It's time to duel. See, each card has an attack number and... That's such a shitty card. So apparently the manga of this is really good, uh, but the anime wanted to focus more on on selling actual products, so it's more based on the on the card. But and a defense number. <laughs> First player to eliminate their opponent's life points wins the duel. Pretty good move, huh? You Pretty good move, huh? I placed the card on the field. Pretty good move, huh? I know this is for kids, but I can't get over how dumb it is. Yugi, pretty good move, but not good enough. Oh my god! That's a better card. This is literally what we used to do when we didn't know because uh, Too many brain thoughts too many brain thoughts. My brain is overloading. Okay when I was a kid Hey, I don't remember your name It was some sort of foreign name and and I will sound racist if I say it but This little fucker didn't know how to play Pokemon. You know who you are. I bet you're watching He was like, oh, I know the rules of Pokemon. I'm like, all right, let's play it Let's play Pokemon then. He's like, all right, so basically uh, you just pick the first card of your deck and you place it down. And the, whoever has like the strongest card uh, wins the other person's card. And I'm like, that sounds stupid. And he's like, all right, place your card. And I'm like, all right, uh, it's some Volpix or some shit. And he just pulls out a Charizard right away. He's like, all right, your card is mine now. I'm like, no. So that's how dual links work. <laughs> <laughs> they figured it out because no one knew how to play the games even though they're so simple What? Thanks a lot Thanks a lot Thanks for beating me. What the hell? Why would you say that? I wonder what the Japanese version is. Thanks Why would you say sarcastically? Thanks if someone beats you at a game? Thanks a God, lot that Powerful totally wipes me out. Whoa, you stink at this game, Joey. Nah, <laughs> you did fine, Joey I just have better cards. See damn Way to rub it in. He just had better my cards. My grandpa owns a game shop and I get all my best cards from him. <laughs> That's not fair. <laughs> Privilege Yugi and his stinky grandpa. He's basically the equivalent of my dad works for Nintendo. My my grandpa has a game shop. Your own game shop? What are we waiting for? Let's go. Okay. Maybe I can even get my grandpa to That's show my us hero. the super rare card right. he's got. Oh rare card. Rare card. Could they have found the card that I've been searching for? <laughs> How did they do this voice acting unironically? Rare card. Could they have been the searching card? <laughs> I can't even speak. Rare card. My god. Kaiba is my man. Gramps, could you show my friends your awesome super rare card? Rare card? My special card? Hmm. Please, please. Pretty please. That's a tough one. That's a tough choice. Should he show the rare card? Is Grandpa going to show the super duper rare card? I mean, you can't just show a rare card to anyone. This is how you know this is not realistic, because anyone that has a rare card could not stop themselves from showing the rare card. It's like nobody. Hey, have I showed you my rare card? Ah, uh, how can I refuse? You exactly. kids are in for a treat. I don't take this card out too often. Ready? Here it is. What? <laughs> Blue Ice White Dragon! He hasn't f***ing boxed it. You have a super rare card and you haven't even put the laminating plastic over it. And you're running a game shop? 
Grandpa, you don't know what you're talking Blue about. Blue eyes, white dragon. So rare, so powerful, I never let it leave my hands. Awesome. Oh. Hmm. Doesn't look ah! all that special to me. Ah, this card is priceless. There are only four of them in all the world. Speaking of priceless, I'm ready to trade. Not for this card. Huh? Dude, look at him. Look at him. Psychopath. He's like Gollum in Lord of the Rings with this card. In comes Kaiba. Of course, he wants the card. Kaiba? Doesn't he have a big fancy company to run? What's he doing down here? I mean, he also goes to school. <laughs> Doesn't he have a big fancy company to run? Why is he in school? Not that it's any of your business, but I came to see the card. So he wants the card. Kaiba is like, oh, give me the card. Grandpa is like, nah, I got this card from someone special. It is the card I've been searching for. Well, enough window shopping. Is there anything else I can help you with? Oh. oh! Listen to me, old man. Give me your blue eyes white dragon card and I'll trade you all of these. <gasps> oh, 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 oh. Wow, 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 damn, damn. I never even seen these. Are these, are these real? I can't tell. He so got the card from a friend, so he's not gonna question. give it up. No. <laughs> no! I've heard enough of your nonsense, senile old fool. These cards are all about power, and one way or another, his blue eyes white dragon card will be mine. Dude, look how static this is. That's awesome. That's some vibe shit right there, look at that. Pinkish car, tone from the sky, that's amazing. And the maze art, you don't understand. All right, but it gets it gets more confusing. All right, I guess this is company, Kaiba Gentlemen, company. There's a little something I'd like you to pick up for me at the game shop. At the game shop, the one game shop. Good morning. Mm -hmm. My master Seto Kaiba challenges you to a duel. You will come with us now. And if I were to decline, I'm afraid I must insist. Young Kaiba doesn't understand, but I'll teach him a lesson about the heart of the cards. Kaiba basically kidnaps <laughs> Yugi's granddad for a doll. Amazing. Has some cool cards today. Me too. Yeah. Look how Yugi's walking. How tall is Yugi? He's like half the length of everyone. Man, I hope he has some cool cards today. Me too. Yeah. Why would the cards change the day from the- You've never even been in the shop before. Man, I hope he has some cool cards today. The writing doesn't make any sense, and I- Why do I care? Hey! Hey, Gramps! Grandpa, I'm home! Maybe he... Went Died. Out. Damn Maybe, it. but why would he leave the door unlocked? Hello? Game shop? Ah, uh, Yugi. Perfect. Kaiba? Your grandfather's here visiting, but he's not feeling well. We fucked his granddad up. This is when the show just gets so confusing, and I, I love it. Huh? <sighs> Grandpa! Grandpa! What did he do to him? They played cards. Why is he dying? Why is he on the floor? What happened? I want to know. I need to know what happened. What did he do to his granddad? Are you okay? <laughs> Yugi, I feel... He's all sweaty! I wanted to teach that boy Kaiba a lesson about the heart of the cards, but I lost. <laughs> and now I'm dying for no reason. <laughs> so the whole concept is that Kaiba believes in the power of the cards, but granddad is like, there's hearts in the cards. Yes, actual hearts in the cards. You believe in the cards and you get good cards. Basically, if I'm like, I believe I draw a good card because I believe in heart of cards. That's the concept of Yugi. I just explained it. How's the old man feeling? Hmm? <laughs> what did he do to him? How's he feeling? He's dying. He's dying. Kaiba, you sleaze. What have you done to him? We had a duel, that's all. With each of us <laughs> putting up our most valuable card as the prize. And look at the sweet <gasps> prize I won. No! <laughs> If he won it, why did he have to destroy it? Can someone explain? If he has three, you're allowed to have four in a deck. Does he know that? Just say it. he did not have to do that. Yes, the blue eyes white dragon is a rare and powerful card. And this one will never be used against me. You could have just put it in your own deck. Uh, my blue eyes white dragon. My, uh, my treasure. Uh, oh, he's well, dying more now. He's definitely on. dying now. How could you do such a thing? Yugi, here. Take <laughs> this. 
<laughs> Yugi! Take this! But clearly it doesn't work. Your garbage deck is not good enough, Grandad. How I put my soul in these cards. And I taught you everything I know, Yugi. Take them. Take Dang. my cards and teach him respect. Teach him respect. I think it's a little too late for that. He, de he destroyed your card. That was the whole point. Teach Kaiba respect for the heart of the cards, Yugi. But Grandpa, you need help. I've got to get you to a doctor. Sounds. <laughs> but Grandpa, you need help. We can take care of your Grandpa while you take care of creepy Kaiba. Teach that rich spoiled brat what a real duel's all about. Just go and help your granddad. What are you doing? Everyone, put your hands together. Oh yeah, she gets this good idea to draw a smiley face over everyone's hand. It doesn't even look like a smiley face. What is that? Maybe in the Japanese version, they draw an actual kanji. Maybe that's why of like friendship. You can't really do that. So they just drew it. It's my, I really want to know if that's the case. All right. Okay. It's still, it's still a smiley face. It's more dramatic on the Japanese one. I just really. So they take him to the hospital. We each begin with 2000 life points. First player to hit zero loses. So how are they going to make a card game interesting for an anime? Well, of course, virtual epic arena. So epic. For whatever reason, Yugi has this thing around his neck. Like, it looks like the most uncomfortable thing you could possibly carry around your neck. But he's been carrying it around his neck because for whatever reason. And it makes him transform. You know, in other animation like Sailor Moon, that there's like this cool transformation scene every time she transformed, right? With Yu-Gi-Oh, it's the same thing, except it just he just screams Yu-Gi-Oh and that's it. And his balls drop because his voice gets ten times deeper. Here we go! Uh, what the? Now, Kaiba, prepare what? yourself because it's <laughs> time to duel. Just instant puberty right there. That's how it happens. So let's begin. I attack with the mighty Hitatsumi Giant. All right, so they play epically. There's no point in me really showing this. Ha, your fierce knight is destroyed. But Kaiba doesn't just summon one blue S white dragon, or two Why blue S white dragon. Defeat, Yugi? But three blue eyes white dragon. Uh, for some reason, Grandpa in the hospital as well can follow what's going on. Look at him. Don't give up, Yugi. Don't give up! Don't give up! You have to win! Why? Grandpa's counting on me. <gasps> Don't A give up, card. Yugi! Swords of Revealing Light! It stops all monsters on the field for three turns. How desperate. Then he also talks to his granddad. For someone claiming to have faith, you're giving up too easily, Yugi. Listen, sometimes the cards are like a puzzle. You have to put all the different pieces in their proper place. Shut up, you're dying, Grandpa! I like the animation as well of the attacks. Wait, what is that? Your judgment falls! Oh. Three blue eyes, white dragons. My god. It's almost like you could have had fourth if you just didn't destroy it! That would have been so cool. But anyway. <laughs> He's about to assemble. Okay, I understand this is very complex, but he's about to assemble the unstoppable Exodia. You need five cards on the board, and if you get all of them, you win the game. It's never been done before. But Yugi doesn't believe in himself. He doesn't, he doubts the heart of the cards. This is of Exodia, but the odds are against me. The odds are against him. I don't think I can do this. <gasps> oh, the cards are going away now. The deck, it senses my doubt. <laughs> What? Don't lose focus, Yugi. Don't lose faith. Concentrate. My deck senses my doubt. Who wrote this? It's so good. Huh? Our friendship symbol. Yes. It's so Yugi, dumb. We're right here with you. But it's so good. Yugi, you've got to believe in yourself. The same card will show up regardless. Does he understand that? I guess I don't believe in the heart of the cards. God damn it. <laughs> Here it is, here it is. Here's the best line of the whole entire anime. Draw your last pathetic card so I can end this, Yugi. My grandpa's deck has no pathetic cards, Kaiba. 
My grandpa's deck doesn't have any pathetic cards, Kaiba. So good. That's writing. That's But art. it does contain the unstoppable <laughs> Exodia. No! Oh, impossible! Uh. I've assembled all five special cards. All five. Couldn't he had at least put them so he makes the shape like that? Couldn't you at least put them like that? I mean, that's pretty badass. Not gonna lie. That's pretty cool. Five pieces of the puzzle. Exodia. Jesus not Christ. Possible. Don't look no too sharp there, Kevin. Able to call him. Here it is. Exodia. You ready for the main? Obliterate! <laughs> you did it! You play only for power, Kaiba, and that is why you lost. But if you put your heart in the game, there is nothing you can't do. But, but how? But believing in the heart of the game is such a weak mindset. <laughs> but the phrase, just a game, is such a weak mindset. Him, how could Kaiba, I have possibly? If you truly. Oh, yeah, here it gets even more confusing here. Okay. Want to know. Open your mind! What is going on? What is happening? What did he just do to him? It just, it just doesn't, it, it just does, it just does it. There, Kaiba. Then, Maybe now you will begin to see. Damn. Oh, yeah. Oh. Grand Grandpa. Grandpa's awake. Yugi won. Yugi won. <laughs> he just knew. Yugi won. Shut up, Grandad. Mr. Pegasus, sir. Seto Kaiba, our uncontested champion. He's been defeated. Oh, my God. So the new enemy is introduced. Pegasus, who's his character trait is that he's drinking wine. And I swear to God for because I watched the whole season for like 10 episodes. All he does is drink wine. He must be absolutely hammered. Uh, so, yeah, that's episode one of Yu-Gi-Oh. I think it's great. I know I'm over 30. I'm not I'm not supposed to enjoy these things, but it's so bad that it's good. You have to understand that distinction. I'm not going to spoil what happens, but basically Yugi's grandpa gets stuck in the shadow realm. So Yugi has to do will Pegasus and Joey and Joey jo joins along. What, I'll show the picture of Joey. The reason why Joey has to win is because his sister Serenity, which he hasn't seen in years, might go blind if he doesn't win. That's believing Joey draws a terrible card. Oh, yeah, it's all coming together. So yeah. Yu-Gi-Oh! Season 1, highly recommended. It's a great anime. I apologize for this video, but smash like if you enjoyed regardless. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. 68% of you are subscribed. Come on, subscribe today. Bye-bye. Hey, Do. Hey, Do.